Hello everyone, welcome back to the Trash Talk channel. In my previous video, I showed you evidence of somebody colluding in some high stakes fantasy basketball leagues. I'm gonna follow up on that, but before I do, I just wanna point out how stupid the scammer was. I mean, come on. So first of all, he joined a $500 league and a $250 league with two teams, which means he put $1,500 in. His maximum upside was a profit of $3,000. So he needed to win both leagues to profit $3,000 just doesn't seem worth it. He had to draft two teams in each league. He had to make those accounts. Um, he had to simultaneously draft two auction teams, which sounds really hard. You'd have to draft two good teams in order to be able to collude to make one super team. And then your one super team has to actually win, which we know even, even a great team in fantasy basketball loses once in a while. So I just don't understand. I think this is the stupidest scammer of all time. Kevin, I hope you're watching. Um, that's probably not your name, but this is ridiculous. You ruined two of our fantasy basketball leagues uh, just to try to scam us. And, and you know what? People who play high stakes category fantasy basketball are smart people. You're trying to scam smart people. We figured you out before the season even started, man. That was That was just the dumbest scam that... I mean, not that I've ever seen, but just really, really stupid scam. So as a follow-up to that, we actually have evidence from League Safe that he had two accounts and made with the same person. So um, League Safe confirmed that it was one person having two accounts in the other league. So we know he did it in both leagues. Um, it turns out that Fantrax, uh, for some reason, allowed him to pull his money out. So we now have... Um, 12 drafted teams, two are empty, and 10 are paid for. So um, I said in my previous video that the we have you could have a free roll on this league. Uh, I didn't know at the time when I posted that video that they were going to get their money back, which is ridiculous. The fan tracks would allow that after drafting the team. I've been trying to get in touch with them, and they haven't responded. So um, I'm vehemently against fan tracks right now. Um, despite the fact that I have a draft on Fantrax later today, which I'll be posting, um, but I already joined the league, so nothing I can do about that. Um, so hopefully we get a sponsorship from Fantrax because, um, you know, they owe us some money. So if you're interested in this league, drop, drop a comment down low. Uh, here's the deal. We have two open spots in a $500 entry league and two open spots in a $250 entry league. What we're trying to do is offer two people the chance to join both leagues for $500. So you will get a free roll in the $250 league. You can, um, the other the other idea is to take those two teams in each league. Whoever, when we find two people to join, we'll do a snake draft between those teams to kind of divvy up the players so that you don't get stuck with um, one or the other team. So let me know down below in the comments if you're interested in um, joining. Uh, I know 500 bucks is a pretty big entry fee for a lot of people, uh, but you get a free roll at a $250 league. The grand prize in that league is $1,500. So um, a free chance to win $1,500. I know you don't draft the team, but I don't know. It doesn't seem so bad to me. If, if I had this opportunity, I don't know if I would take it, but I can't because I'm already in the league. All right, guys, I've got um, three drafts today. I'm going to be recording all of them. Not sure if we'll post all of them, but um, stay tuned. We've got a lot of good content coming your way this weekend. Have a good one.